He's looking really agitated. <gasps> Put it up, he's got a ball, he's got a ball. She's even. Oh, Ash! Hi guys and welcome back to another vlog. It's been a while, I can't lie. I haven't had anything exciting to show and share with you guys today. I've arrived in Wales with Adiola. We're in Wales, 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 Wales. Where is Wales? Um, in England. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so basically this trip is so spontaneous. I think it's spontaneous because Adiola literally texted me maybe a month ago and was like, I think you said something like, I like this, do you like this place? I booked it. I was it. like, babe, we're going well. Yeah, I booked it. Like, I was like, babe, do you want to go well? And I said, babe, we're going well. Babe, yeah. I booked well. Yeah, so she's that kind of person. Ajo doesn't wait, she just yeah. does it. And, and it's just like, you need a friend like that. She's the friend that will make you, she'll book the flight so you can't actually say no. Yeah. <laughs> I think tomorrow I'll do a tour. I just got her videographer here, so her one I'm really excited to watch because I think she, we, oh, she got a drawing and everything's sick. Basically, guys, if you like this little right. vlog that I do on my channel, I'll make sure you like it because then I'm going to do more. Exactly. So she's gonna do all of that tomorrow. So I'm gonna probably watch her, and then I'll also show you guys the the vibe properly. Oh, but I'm gonna leave a sneak preview of our bedroom so far so basically i'm going to share with adjola tonight because well for the rest of the trip because yeah <laughs> guys it's, it's scary, scary. adjola's the kind of person she likes her space I so like sleep by she likes to sleep by herself and when we want to do sleepover she's like bye i'm going I'm home nice. yeah. yeah we there's three bedrooms so i was like okay and I'll have three, three of us three of us and then I'll sleep in my head. Okay, cool. Mimi never sleeps in my bed, but tonight. And she was talking like, oh, I think I'm gonna sleep with Mimi in my bed. And I was like, babe, we can share. She was like, oh, really? oh, no. You guys don't, I feel like when you see, when you show them, they're really deep. We're really in the middle of nowhere. No, right? There's and no dry, street light. Nothing. No outside nothing. light. So if you look outside, it's like you're closing your eyes. You yeah. can just see pitch and it's like black. People will probably see the inside, inside but we can't. got the light on. But we can't look outside. So someone could be outside just looking at us like this. And, and we, we won't really know. And we watch so many horror films. So many. But basically, there's this family, there's this woman, she lives by herself in like a place like this. And then people come in masks and oh. they come and try to break in with yeah. like hammers. Oh, sweetie. <laughs> no, I think so. Ash! Did you say something? Okay. Should we pray tonight? 100%. Yeah, because this is a bit much. Okay. Uh, and sometimes she just randomly barks <sighs> and she stares and barks, and I just. And it's like, what's, what, there, what's babe? there, babe? Oh, bless her, she's so cute. <laughs> Guys, Mimi's hair. You're having a great time. You've got so much space, isn't it? I know. And she was so good in the car. So for four good hours. in the car. She just slept pretty much all of it. I really like her. She's a really lovely dog. But yeah, guys, so we're gonna just chill for the rest of the night. Yeah, we're just gonna make her hello fresh. <laughs> and then just chill, chill. watch a movie. Yeah, and just and then start again tomorrow. Mm -hmm. So bye guys. So guys, this is the room that I was talking about with Adjurina that is super, super scary. Like it's giving me the light in here is amazing. I'm definitely gonna take my selfie here. But it's giving me like dungeon vibes. One. It's very therapeutic. <laughs> so yeah guys, that was the, the relaxing room. Welcome to my kitchen. So this is the kitchen. So the reason why I wanted this kitchen so much was the metal bar. Island. Island. 
Adiola. She helped me design this amazing Guys, this deal is literally straight from Egypt. I had to get them. It literally takes so long to melt. What it is about this deal basically is that it's rare and I, obviously I had to have the best for her and she was like, she literally wanted this still so I had to get it imported Oh, and don't even start on the tax imports Because we have to get permission from oh. the Egyptian goddess to be like, we can use this still because they literally use this in them um, for the pyramids What? Bro, what are you talking about, man? Like at the end of the day, you can't have like a basic metal no, um, bus, bar island. island. It, it has doesn't to be make premium. no sense. So, you know, I'm just proud of the finish. You should look. be. You, you should be. You take excellence to another level, and, and this is exactly why I hired you to design this island. Honestly, AP. I took my time with this house for you, and I'm happy you like it. This I is what it. I love doing. I love creating homes for people that they can spend the rest of their life, and every room yes. and everything in the house is meaningful for you. Yeah. So I'm happy. I'm happy, and another well done to you, Adiola. Thank you, babe. I'll send the check. Enjoy your new home. I like early starts. I feel like. It's getting darker now, so it's better to just wake up early, get all the things you want to get done whilst there's light, and then you finish late earlier. I love. I want to finish when it's time to get dark. Yeah. And we can just chill because that's what we came here to do, right? We always have to be in like work mode, and it's like sometimes it's kind of hard because you know, like you want to enjoy something, but at the same time, it's like you don't get that opportunity yeah. again to create like your content. In that moment in as that well. Moment. And sometimes I feel like, oh, they think, oh, they complain. It's not that we complain. No, it's not that. I feel it's really hard to percent gonna not complain about their job. There's always yeah, something. Yeah, there's always just, just little bits, like you just are never fully turned off ever. I don't mm. think there's been a time, even when I'm like off, it's like, oh, shit, I should be doing something. Yeah. We're gonna make some tea now. Um, yeah, we have to get a move on of the day. We've got a lot to, to do, do, and it all rides on how long I can take to get ready. Exactly. So, and my the sun is really start. Yeah. Okay, guys. So this is the room. I wanted to talk on this one because I just feel like we have such a good room. I think we got the um, the best one because of this. Look how nice this is. There's a whole freaking bathtub in the bedroom and then look at the beds. It's just so lovely and tranquil. And then this is the bathroom. So we have a lovely shower and then we have the toilet. We have me over here. Like look how pretty it is. And then we also have the cupboards and Adiola over there. <laughs> So this room's a bit more funkier, like each room has a different theme. So I don't know if you guys can see, like, look, there's books in this one. It's like very like neutral, this way you can read. John Armstrong, how to worry less about money. Um, the wealth of nations. Open city, onto this last. And then Mimi just literally follows me everywhere. Why are you always following me? I like this room because it has all the CDs. Like, this is giving me serious nostalgic vibes. And um, it looks like Ash has picked up something to listen to. What did he pick up? D'Angelo. Okay, I listened to some D'Angelo this morning. But um, this is so cute. I love this concept in a bedroom. So um, that is the inside of the property. We catch up with you guys when we're getting ready. See you guys in a bit. I'm just gonna get a fork in her bed. I really asked her, oh, does anybody recording. want some noodles? And she was like, no. Oh. I said no because I did it and then I smelt it and I was like, whoa. That was That's what we call a logic cockerel. How is that a logic cockerel? It is a logic cockerel. How? Because I asked you, do you want some? I'm dishing and the I last bits no. of noodles and exactly. you said no. Exactly. So then if someone now comes and sits next to you and yeah. you're eating and then you're like, I'm gonna go get a fork. But I asked you, can I have a bite? A bite, babe. Yeah. You're getting a whole fork. <laughs> so you're just gonna leave your fork in the plate, and no. anytime time you wanna be coming in and out, she's gonna be like, mm mm. Guys. Oh my god. It's like when you just ask people for food and they say no and they wanna come eat your food. <laughs> But what difference does it make is a bite? Babe, it's like because I've portioned this is what I'm eating in my head and that bite that you're going to have, yeah. I could have had it. 
Do you know what I mean? You know, I get that, but sharing is caring. I know? get it, but it's like, I could have mentally... Is it much if I'm not No, but I... <laughs> Pick a chicken. Okay. But the thing is, I would have mentally prepared that I'm sharing, but no, you I get mentally that. prepared But me. you're giving me a bite. Okay, are you going to leave it as that, yeah? Because mm. you said a bite. Let me mm. take the biggest chicken now, because mine's at this rate, so you can't try to take the chicken. Mm -hmm. Thank you, you're so sweet. Friends that, you know, don't be stingy are the best ones. Mmm. We're basically sharing it now. Mm-mm, we're -mm, sure. I'm Baby, you can share it. I don't feel like the guy. No, share it is fine. No, it's fine. Are you sure? Yeah. Because I don't mind. Oh, Honestly, no, like, I know. I won't care. I don't know how I feel though. I feel like I want to eat, but I'm not. Really but don't, eat. don't, um, don't stop for my account. No, I wouldn't, anyways. Okay, so guys, we're about to go. Where are we going? Gonna go co op, get some food, and also like see the scenery during the day for where we're gonna go maybe tomorrow. Yeah, because we wanna know where we wanna go and sightsee. Because exactly. I definitely wanna go sightsee. hiking and stuff. Oh, this is the best part. So, um, <laughs> yeah. Oh, okay. £1.55 which is basically £2. That's crazy to me. Even that for one forty five, it's like, it, it's never that expensive. Okay, so guys, it's the evening now. And um, Adriola cooked. I helped a little bit, didn't I? Yeah, yeah we cooked together. Hello Fresh. She brought me on. I'm bringing you guys on as well. It's so good. So this is what um, we made. So this is a uh, chicken breast with the ham. Potatoes, roast with some cheese, broccoli with some pepper sprinkles, and what sauce is this? Um, it's like creamy sauce. Cre <laughs> it's like creamy sauce. Creamy sauce. It's so nice. Good morning, everyone. It is Wednesday today, so yesterday, we did, oh yesterday, what did we do? So yesterday was pretty much getting our dedicated, like paid content out of the way first because I hate being behind, Adriella hates being behind, so we'd rather just get the stuff done. And we did that pretty much in the house. And then today, um, we are going to basically go out and about today. So we're gonna go into town, we're gonna sightsee, we're gonna do a bit of a hike, like, we woke up at six, I'm about, it's eight o'clock now, so I'm gonna get ready. I've taken Mimi out, done all that stuff. We got the sickest um, video of the sunrise. Um, my camera probably doesn't do it justice, but Adriana's vlog's got it and it looks so beautiful. So if you wanna see it more crisp and HD, make sure you check out her vlog as well. And I had this smell of like, do you guys remember when you were at school and you'd go to a school early in the morning and I used to walk to school sometimes and there was this smell it was like a woody earthy smell and it is oh my god just waking up being outside i got that it was so nostalgic so i'm gonna do my makeup um because we need to be done by 12. one thing i regret is i wish i packed another wig i usually do but i didn't so today's plan of acting because i did want my hair to look a bit different like some days curly some days up in a bun so today we're going to be out and about pretty much the whole day so i'm going to have my hair straight as normal i'll take my time gluing it this time and then i'll change it in like a little low ponytail and a bun um for when i change my look so it gives it a bit more option today if i do all my day shots i'm happy and then tomorrow will be like extras like lounge stuff like you know my chill out clothes and i've got some i've got three nighttime looks that i really want to get a shot in and to be fair i want the shots of the nighttime look in the house so the rest of my other looks will be outside for, for today so yeah i think i've planned my work really well i'm happy with the photos and i think one thing about when you guys go to take content with your friends you guys need to know go in there 
and make sure you know what kind of content you want um, have examples plan the outfits for the location like a lot of prepping and time goes into it and obviously investing in different locations so doing stuff like this really does like feel good and it motivates so let me get ready now because i have to be ready before adiola because she takes 10 minutes and i take about four hours and i don't know how i honestly don't but doing stuff like this is why i'm always late so i'll catch up with you guys once i'm ready hey guys so we are on our way now makeup's done glam done adiola driving and we're off to the valley now i said it earlier there isn't the sun's gone a little bit you guys saw this morning how golden um the weather was but now it's a bit cloudy and these scenes are just magnificent <laughs> guys we've just stopped off because of this view i just want i just wanted to show you guys A few moments later we've stopped again guys this is just serious sensational scenes i am just we might see a sheep on the hill a sheep on the hill we might do i hope we do this is just incredible <gasps> look at this just look at that look at this that's what i'm talking about basically we're going down somewhere and we didn't wear the right shoes for the attack for we just kind of have to crouch as <laughs> we walk so guys i can't do it a few moments later <gasps> it's raining guys what the fuck Let's go. Oh, oh guys it's proper raining oh at least we tried to do it we tried we actually are in Wales. We're in Wales. <sighs> the water looks just so shiny. Like the sunset. Look, there's some there. So if we keep driving, we'll, we'll get. <laughs> Guys, we're trying to get to that sunshine. <laughs> And just me. put the they <laughs> in real life. It's not just for the He's looking really agitated. <gasps> put it up, he's got a ball, he's got a ball. even Oh Ash! <laughs> I think they're planning against they're conspiracy and against us. They look scary! Move! So guys, we're off to get some food now, and it's been a really weird weather. If that even made any sense. So it, does that look like the thing? Yeah, One a bit of a quest. Giving me the vibe. Should we ask for the hafu for logs? Yeah. Look. look. This is too cute. <laughs> do you sell logs? Logs, yes, we do. And the thing, the um, the kalalo. What? The Kindle. Kindling. Kindling. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you guys have a blog or something? Or? Yeah, yeah. We came to Wales. Nice. Where are you staying? Vacation. Where are um, we it's like in the country. Like it's just yeah. nothing there. <laughs> Most of that is like less around here. But the house oh, like, literally, literally is literally oh, right. in a field. Yeah. Nice. Well, we don't well, have you yes, show them the gains because well, of Jim. Look at her. <laughs> well, um, what jeans are these, babe? PLT. What jacket are you wearing? Outfit is PLT, baby. Yes. Look like an IG model. Walk with a wall. Body shape like a Coke bottle. Put stay on full throttle. Love it when I swap. I'm <laughs> 
done really well. <sighs> we tried. We tried. I think that was a good TikTok session. Like a TikTok. It was. <sighs> so, right, makeup off, wig off. Time to just wig do off. Bit lucky. Evening, guys. The last hey, night. Guys. It's the last supper. How does everyone reference that? Like every time it's like the end of the night, it's like it's the last supper. God forbid we have many more suppers to come. Amen. We did wake up <laughs> early this morning though. I went for a yeah. walk. Yeah, the walk was so, was so nice. I don't think nice. I actually said it to you guys, but it was so lovely. It was just cold and we were just standing out there with our cup of tea, having a chin mug. We are going to make some cocktails. Yes. Mine makes this really nice gin cocktail. Oh. Hi guys. Oh. Hello. So, okay, so we're doing it together. So you can start off by slicing the lime. Well, you know well, what, what can I do? <laughs> Something else. <laughs> so we have gin. It doesn't matter what gin. Well, she can't reach. Oh, you got it. You got it. Yeah, babe, I'm tall. Wow. So we've got this, this, and then the elderflower drink. And then we need some ice. Ooh. <laughs> we've got the ice, and then we need the glasses. Yeah. When you say glasses, you mean... We want to make it fancy. Okay. Oh, like this? Yeah. Oh, yes. Okay, so, so the art of rinse. this is just go with the flow. I don't think I know how to cut, cut lemon slices. Baby, just slice it. I know, but I just feel like... By the way, you're not getting much juice on you. I know you didn't want to do that to begin with. But I just think that's a bit messy. Mm -hmm. There was one time when I was um, exploring Colombia. Oh, wow, Colombia. Mm -hmm. I was diving in the deep, deep sea. Mm -hmm. Was it blue? It was blue. <sighs> And then there was this abandoned boat mm -hmm. on their scene. Mm -hmm. And there was this red jacket. And I was like, why is there a red jacket? Mm -hmm. right? And it just looked like it was like a new jacket. Mm -hmm. I went closer to the jacket. Mm -hmm. And the jacket just smelled so beautiful. Really? What does it smell And I was like, like, how can I smell under the sea? <laughs> and Not many was, people can do that. Oh, and the feeling the jacket gave me it was as if I had just been like refreshed and born again when i came back up i just felt so strong so i will never forget that red jacket <laughs> and that reminds me of grace <laughs> the first thing you do you take the gym okay i never liked gin until literally one day me and my partner, we went out, and this is a true story, guys. Me and my partner, we went out, and um, one of his guy friends mm -hmm. had a girlfriend, right. and she made this amazing gin and tonic drink. And I was like, to her babe, what's the ingredients? And she, and she told me. And, and was I, it this? Yes. And so it's not your recipe, being you? I've remixed it, because she didn't add lime. Okay, cool. <laughs> so, so after that, that, we put what, a dash of gin, or what's, what's this that? Is, this will be probably okay, about two shots. Shot. And then after that, we like to put some ice. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we're gonna put that in. Yes. And then we just need, I'd say one more ice. Just gonna break it. Maybe. Just smash it. No, because it's not gonna come out. Um, as we were saying, so then we go in with the sparkling elderflower. And then I put about that much in, because I like mine really sweet. Go in with the tonic water. This is Indian tonic water by Schweppes. Guys, 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 guys. Why are you so annoying, man? Trust you to what do the that. That, never <laughs> That's a... that actually never happens. Wow. Take two guys, apologies. So we're gonna slowly open the swaps and then you're gonna pop it inside to about here. Obviously if you had more eyes, it would look so much better. And then you give it a little stir. Go on. So now we want you to add the lemons. <sighs> one, two. 
and then you're gonna add some lime one two and then usually you add a little bit of cucumber but we forgot the cucumber and then we're going to literally cut a little slice there a little bit slice there and put the lemon there do the same with the lime do that little slice and then there we go we have a gin and tonic elderflower cocktail should i give it a taste test yes so <clears> why don't you Mm. You get it right every time. Wow, thank you. It's really good, babe. I would recommend it, especially if you guys go on a night out, you want like a group cocktail. This is a good one. It's, to it's, it's it. a bit stronger than what you normally do. Oh, I did put quite a lot though. You know, it's fine. Okay, cool. That is how you make the Mario Musa styled. Um, say it again. Gin and tonic elderflower cocktail. Thanks for having me, babe. Anytime. That is us over and out. <laughs> Kaylee, Adriana, and Mimi have really bonded this trip. She's my baby, guys. She's like three months. Sometimes in the morning, we have these moments. It's okay, baby. It's okay, baby. It's like I've got you, baby. Oh, baby. It's so nice. Try it. It's the last yeah. day. The end of the road. How does that sound like? And I can't, I can't let you go. It's all natural. You, you belong, belong to me. I belong to you. this comes up because i know i'm still got probably another vlog to upload before this one but make sure you check out our journeys because that's where the cinematic of this trip really comes to life hope you guys love this we're on our way home now peace Bye. out